Now, anyone who drives along the Woodhead Pass in Derbyshire will know how congested that road can get. One company in Derbyshire, though, thinks it has the answer. Great Northern wants to reopen a disused railway line which runs along the route and create a rolling highway where trains could carry lorries. More from our transport correspondent, Judy Hobson. These lorries are all heading over Woodhead Pass. For years, villagers like Mottram and Hollingworth have struggled with the amount of congestion and pollution they cause. During rush hour, it's just complete uh, standstill. But it's really, really bad. And this road's so dangerous with kids. It's all these wagons, really. It's, you, just can't, you can't get up the moor if you want to go to Hyde. It takes, you, it takes you ages to get through all the traffic. Could this man have the answer? It's a very big tunnel. We'll be able to get the tallest, or well, 90% of the wagons on the road could, we'll be able to go through this tunnel. He wants to reopen the old railway line which runs across Woodhead and put lorries onto trains. Essentially, it'll just take all, this, all these wagons, all these lorries off the roads. So it'll reduce pollution. How many accidents do we see daily on the Pennines? Traffic jams, and it's just killing our industry in the north and we need to do something about it. This is what a so-called rolling highway looks like. These lorries are heading through the Channel Tunnel. Great Northern's idea is for wagons to board at Breadbury and a light at Tinsley near Sheffield. It would cost lorry firms £130 per journey. There was a mixed reaction from hauliers that I spoke to. <laughs> The line across Woodhead closed to passengers in 1970 and to freight in 1981. The idea of reopening it has been talked about for years. Opening disused railway lines like this is a difficult process and it's expensive. And although the government has promised to look at these kinds of routes, there's no new money for it. But residents here say something has to be done about the increasing volume of traffic. Judy Hobson, BBC Northwest Today, Hollingworth.